Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen. I'm Mindy. If you haven't been here before, welcome. And if you have been here before, welcome back. I hope everybody is having a fantastic day. Today, I'm going to be making another casserole. I feel like I should change the name of my channel to the casserole queen at this point, but it's what works for us. I have made something similar to this, but not quite like this one. So I hope you will stay tuned and enjoy, and I will let you know at the end exactly what I think of this recipe. These are the ingredients that we're going to be using. It called for three cups of chicken. I had three chicken breasts in my freezer, so I just boiled those and shredded them up. You can use canned chicken, rotisserie chicken, whatever kind of chicken you want to use. This is what I had, so this is what I'm using. We're going to use one tablespoon of this ranch dressing mix, eight ounces of cream cheese, half cup of milk, one can of cream of chicken soup, one cup of the crispy fried, this, French's crispy fried onions. And we need one cup of crushed up potato chips and 12 ounces of egg noodles. The first thing I'm going to do is cook the noodles. And while the noodles are cooking, we will stir together the sauce. And I forgot to mention, we need one cup of shredded cheddar. I'm using mild cheddar. I have softened the cream cheese in the microwave. I am going to add the half a cup of milk. Next, we will add the can of cream of chicken soup. And now I'm going to add one tablespoon of the ranch dressing, mix, powder, this. And now we will take the chicken and we will put that in. And now we're going to stir in the one cup of shredded cheddar cheese. And there you have it, guys. Now we just have to wait for the noodles to cook. And then we will get our casserole assembled and in the oven, which I have preheated to 350 degrees. So I will be back very soon. Okay, guys, as you can see, the noodles are cooked. I've added them to the cheesy chicken mixture. Now I'm just going to stir this all together. I have two eight by eight casserole dishes. What I'm going to do with this is I'm gonna divide this into two. One of these will be for today, one of these will be for tomorrow because I don't wanna put the topping on the one for tomorrow because I don't think it'll be crispy if it sits overnight. And now what I'm gonna to do to the one that I'm going to bake this evening, I have crumbled up the potato chips just like that and you put it all over the top. Then you're gonna take the French's onions and just sprinkle these over the top. And there you have it, guys. I'm going to pop this in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes at 350 degrees. I'm just gonna let it bubble and let the top hopefully brown up a little bit. And then we will be back with the taste test. Time for a taste test. I have to say, it smells really good. Fresh out of the oven. Do you see the steam coming off of it? Are you ready for my two cents. I think this is really good. Um, it has a really nice creamy flavor, but then you've got the topping that gives it the crunch and you've got the chicken in there that gives it a little bit more of a chew along with the noodles. Um, I think it's really good. Crispy, crunchy chicken noodle bake. Two thumbs up from me. Okay guys, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm going to eat my dinner, clean up my mess, and call it a day. Thank you so much for watching today. I really do appreciate you all. I hope you will like this video. I hope you will subscribe if you haven't already, and please leave me some comments, and I will see you next time. Bye. Hey guys, I just had to come back and give you an updated two cents. Okay, I didn't like it after all. When it was fresh out of the oven and I took that bite, it was like, oh, this is really good. But then I made a plate and I had dinner and the more I ate it, the less I liked it. And by the time I finished, it was just not good at all. I mean, it was like really not good in my opinion. So I will not be keeping it and sending it for Chris tomorrow because I would actually feel bad putting that in his lunchbox. There's something about it, I don't know, as it cooled, it just got this bitter, kind of gross texture and taste. I tossed it, there will be no leftovers, and I will never, ever make that one again. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap this up again, and I will see you next time. Bye. Hi, guys, it's me, Sadie, and I just have to say, I am so shocked. 
my mama threw that whole chicky casserole in the trash. I told her I would eat it, and she just throwed it away anyway. Oh, well. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you'll like it, even though Mama throwed it in the trash. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!